So the radiation, um, that was, you know, the initial um, treatment um, was, and I believe it was 42 days. I should know the exact number this now by now. But um, so that was good driving. Um, so I had to have my friends and neighbors all signed up on a list to take me every, every day. Um, just during the week, not you got the weekends off, and um, and it it happened real fast. It was only about ten or fifteen minutes. Um, you go in initially, and they fit you for this face mask, and it, it looks like this space helmet, and um, and you just go into the machine and. You don't feel anything. Um, it did. It over time, it did take a toll um, on your on kind of your brain. I mean, it it um, you get kind of tired. I mean, you get very tired. And um, but it it wasn't that bad. Um, it, you know, you just kind of went in and did it. And um, and the um, and I know I was like, well, am I going to lose my hair? Because everyone seems like that has cancer loses their hair, but I didn't. Um, only where the the path of the actual um, radiation beam uh, hit my head, I lost hair, and that was just underneath. You know, it was just kind of right back here, and so I never. No one ever could really tell I lost my hair, but so some you do lose a little, but. Um, I know that's always a worry, um, but the friends coming every week that really opened up um, my social um, aspect to have people there every week to I mean or every day to communicate with and to talk with and um, uh, and so by the last week you're pretty ready to be done with radiation. Um, and so it's great to have the last one. We had a big party on my last um, radiation, and all the people at the you know radiation um, building. I mean, you know, the office are wonderful, and um, y you really feel like you've accomplished something when you do that. Um, and then the chemo, um, I did a year of chemo. And I took oral pills, so I didn't, um, which I think is, oh, gosh, a blessing. Um, there were a few side effects. Um, I think with any cancer treatment, you you get um, dry mouth, and there are some wonderful things out, in the, out that you can buy for dry mouth. And I always had crackers on my bed stand every morning. Um, chemo's not bad, but... Um, steroids, which in brain cancer, you're going to be on steroids. Uh, we always joke in, I think, kind of the brain cancer group that they're like, it's called dexamethasone, and it's kind of like dexamethasone because you hate it, but you love it. <laughs> so I think the, the, the steroids are something that um, you really want because they help you, um, but then they're also kind of a double-edged sword because they're, they're a they're probably worse than the chemo. They just kind of make you feel yucky. And um, but uh, thank goodness for those steroids. <laughs> but um, so the you know the nausea and things that I had were really just because of the type of tumor I had and um, the imbalance and things like that. Um, but it it wasn't. I think it was so much better than what the traditional scary chemotherapy can do to you. It, it wasn't that bad.